Okay, so I had finally got round to um, building these two entry grade kits, um, and I'm really impressed with them. Um, they're both really good builds, really fun. Um, there, I couldn't recommend one over another because they're really great for um, two different reasons. So, like um, the Exceed Galaxy, the Build Strike, that's this one um, on the right. Comes with some really nice parts, um, you know, comes with a core fighter, which is really cool. Um, and then the Lar Gundam is built off of the frame um, of the RX-78 too, but we'll get back to that in a minute. I just want to say I really actually, I enjoyed the the mini series that's up on Gundam Info. Um, it was nice to see old characters come back. Um, and I just, I think this kit is super charming, uh, this Lar Gundam. And I really liked some of the pieces on it. So, um, you know, I, I, I got a couple of these. Um, and it's because... Yeah, so, like, there's a lot of choice. You can build the new um, Lar Gundam. Or, you know, you can go for something a little bit different and build um, a variant RX-78 too, which um, I had to get a couple just to do. Because um, the granddaddy is my guy. Um, I've done some light uh kit bashing with this guy so you can see he's got a backpack from gun cannon um, and i've just applied my own um you know like decals and stuff i always put the bandai thing on there just because um i've always been happy to support bandai and their products um i've, I've was buying their power rangers figures when i was like very very young so um yeah but uh yeah they're definitely these are definitely worth Going out and buying, um, I think they're just over ten pounds, um, and I had a really good time with these, and I'm really, really happy with um, with the variant RX seventy eight too. Um, but the, they have all of the posability of the earlier entry grades um, based on the RX seventy eight two mold. Um, the strike is a little bit different. Yeah, so the um, the build strike, the Exceed Galaxy, comes with um, so many parts, uh, and it's got so many part holes on it as well, so I imagine um, if you've got some 30-minute missions kits, um, you're really going to be able to do some sick part swapping and stuff with that one. Um, this is just, on the left-hand side, this is a Strike Gundam, the entry-grade one, um, and what I did is um, I just... I had to mod these parts, so like the shoulders in the skirt piece, I had to um, modify them in order for them to fit. You can't do this right out of box, um, but you know, whoa, what are you doing? There we go. Um, I've always loved the strike, um, you know, and I've, I, I always like to use that entry grade to um, explore and customise. Um, I'm really happy with this turned out, obviously. I've done some weather on it, weathering on him and stuff. Um, but yeah, go out um, and get these kits because they are really cool. They're definitely worth the money. Um, oh, what else? I've built another couple of. I recently built, let me show you. 